And good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Rod Fowler. Megan Conway has the night off. There was an officer involved shooting today in North Lincoln. Two people had to be taken to the hospital. We also now know the name of the person who was shot by police. Channel 8's Veronica, Veronica Barreto has our latest details in our top story. And at the micro hotel of, of 25th and Fairfield Street, a man was shot this afternoon by a Lincoln police officer. Earlier today, there was a large police presence in this area, but as you can see right now, it's getting back to normal. Acting Police Chief Michonne Morrow says 35-year-old Garrett Hanike was parked in a Jeep at the hotel when an officer approached him. LPD says Hanika was wanted on a federal warrant out of Council Bluffs, Iowa. Police say he rammed into the police cruiser and tried to run over the officer. The driver then, after hitting the cruiser, puts it in drive and accelerates very rapidly again towards the officer. Our officer did fire at the vehicle. Chief Morrow says the officer fired several shots hitting Hanika. During the chaos, a woman got out of the vehicle. The female passenger exits the, the Jeep and as, after he puts it in drive again, after reversing, he actually runs her over. Henike and the woman were taken to a hospital, both with injuries that were not life-threatening. After being medically cleared, Henike was arrested on suspicion of several charges, including first-degree assault. The officer was not injured. The next step from here is to continue the investigation on scene. Certainly, we want to be very careful in collecting all of the necessary evidence, that being physical evidence and any video evidence as well as witness statements. Morrow says the officer was put on administrative leave as part of normal protocol for the investigation. Reporting in Lincoln, Veronica Barreto, Channel 8 News.